Uh, good afternoon, YouTube. I uh, have the old GE Model 150 back up on the bench. I did manage to get the cardboard cover off the main filter cap. And as you can see, it's just a nice metal can underneath there. I don't know why they covered that with paper or cardboard, but they did. So, anyway, that uh, is kind of impossible to do what I wanted to do. I can't see any easy way of getting that off. I, I probably could use my Dremel tool and the cutoff wheel and go around the base of it and get that top off, but that IF can is in the way. The tubes, and, and I got the speaker out of the way, it's laying right there. Um, the tubes around it are easily enough, you know, removed, but that can in the back there is just, uh, there it is back here. Um, I mean, it's just too hard to remove. It's just, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. I, I probably could drill out those rivets around the, the base of it and get it out. I, I could probably just use a terminal strip and mount the new ones to that. Uh, that may be what I end up doing, but what I think I'm going to do is wait on the other radio to get here. I've got another complete radio coming. So once that gets here, I think I'll probably... Um, see if there's any parts I could use off of it uh, that would make it easier or something so not that I, I know of but anyway like I said I just gonna I want to look at it and see what the deal is uh, with it so anyway that's just a quick little update to let you know I got that apart um, it's just I, I've, I've looked at this every way I can think of in the bottom here and it's just uh, going to be too difficult. Oop, I just, <laughs> that wasn't good. And I should have took that off. I didn't do it. But anyway. Let's see if I can get this underneath here. Like this. Alright. You can see a little bit better down in there. That, uh, anyways, down here. Oh, I've got to turn around back or That pointer sticking up really makes it difficult to uh, work on this. Okay, anyway, you can see right there, that's the uh, bottom of the filter cap. Uh, I probably could clip those leads off, and uh, I don't know what to do with it after that, but there's just too much stuff in there around it. And I've, I've also thought about going ahead and replacing the caps there, because that'll give me a little bit more room too. There's a lot of caps in there need to be replaced so you know I've got options but uh, I did get the uh, selenium rectifier loose to get the speaker out <laughs> this thing is one of those deals where you got to take something out to get something else out um, I probably will end up replacing that with the diode um, just because I mean you know it's old and I've got plenty of diodes <laughs> so um, like I say that's where I'm at right now. So I'll give you another update when I have one to give. So thanks for watching. Please feel free to leave a comment too. Thank you.